guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be telling you guys what I use on my hair. I've been getting a lot of questions. Um, I filmed a video like this maybe like two or three months ago. Not a lot has changed, but I have added some new um, products that I use in my hair, so I wanted to update you guys on that. So, if you're new to my channel, welcome, hello, whoop whoop. Make sure to subscribe down below and like this video, only if you like it though. Okay, so let's get into shampoos and conditioners because Obviously, that's the first thing you do. So I recently um, was contacted by this company called Function of Beauty, and they sent me a shampoo and a conditioner, and the really cool thing about um, their stuff, sorry, these are like used. I mean, I use them all the time, but the really cool thing about their line is that you get to formulate what type of things you want in your shampoo and conditioner, which I think is amazing because it's hard to find like a shampoo or a conditioner that meets all of your needs. So they do it for you, they make it really easy. You do like a little test and it's done. And the cute thing is is that they like put your name on there. So this one says Function of Chloe Brown, which I absolutely love it. I chose my own scents and I chose my own coloring too. So I chose to not have color and I chose essential oils as the fragrance. Once a week, I do use this generic um, conditioning shampoo, and this is a purple shampoo, so this takes out all of the orangey, yellow, warm tints in my hair and makes it more cool. So I do use this once a week, and what I do is I just kind of like add it to my shampoo. I don't just use this, um, so I just add it and then keep it on for five minutes and then wash it off once a week, because if not, then my hair is like way too silver. I do like the warmth, but um, I like to keep those cool tones in there too. When I am out of the shower, the first thing I do is brush it out and I add this Paul Mitchell Super Skinny Smoothing Serum. Um, I love this stuff, I think it's great. I also do like finishing touches if I think my hair is too dry some days, um, I'll finish off with this product too. So I always put a dime size, maybe like a nickel size, um, in my palm, rub it all around and put it in my wet hair. Now a question I get asked a lot is if I blow dry my hair and to be honest, I don't. I, I don't like taking the time, I don't like feeling overheated, um, I only do it if I like really have to. So I usually take a shower at nighttime and let my hair air dry and then kind of fix the, <laughs> the moppy mess in the morning. The products that I do use on my hair I am in love with the Croc straightener. It is an infrared straightener and this is the new classic. I've had a Croc straightener for over like seven years now. Um, my old one broke and they were amazing and sent me a new one. So I love Croc. I like tell everybody about my Croc straightener. It's amazing. The curling iron that I use is a one inch curling iron. Um, this is by Ceramic Tools. Um, I like it. Um, my best friend actually bought it for me. She's a hairstylist and I really do like it. So that's cool. On days that I do blow dry my hair, I tend to put ADH dry on the roots of my hair, either before I blow dry or after. You guys have watched me put ADH dry all over my roots, um, bef like right after I straighten or curl my hair. And that is honestly what gives my hair so much lift. I absolutely love it. it has very good memory. It's very flexible, but it's matte. Um, so it doesn't really look like there's anything in your hair, but it adds that volume and texture that you want and need. Um, so I always use it on like my ends too and to keep these babies down. So I love the ADH dry. Another texture spray that I use in my hair is the Kenra Platinum Dry Texture Spray. I do love this stuff a lot. This this is what I use like on touch up days. So I wash my hair every other day. And so on the first day I'll use my ADH dry, kind of get that volume staying in there. The next day the volume is still there, but sometimes you need a little touch up because of oils or whatnot. So I'll just go ahead and just lift up my hair and um, spray this stuff in it. Most days I do like a medium hold hairspray because I do like to move my hair around. If I curl my hair, my hair holds a curl very well. If I straighten it, same thing. It'll hold a, my, my hair doesn't, it just does what it, what I do to it, which is kind of nice. Um, but I'll use the Kenra Medium Hold Hairspray. I love this stuff, it smells really great. I love all Kenra products because they smell so good. Um, so I'll use that. On nights where I know it's gonna be humid outside or I'm gonna be out in the heat and um, I need some extra help, I'll go ahead and use the Big Sexy Hairspray and this stuff is amazing. It holds great, like, 
there's nothing I can complain about about this stuff. I think it's great. It's just not something that I want to use personally every single day. Now, my favorite tool out of all of these is probably my comb. Um, I absolutely love this comb for teasing. I am a hairstyler, so there are not a lot of days where I just don't do my hair and there are not a lot of days where I just like throw my hair up. I really do enjoy doing my hair. I enjoy curling it, I enjoy straightening it, I enjoy adding a lot of body into it. Um, if you've known me for a long time, you know that I love body in my hair and this is what gets the body in my hair. So I love teasing with this brush. And I think this one is from either Salon, I think it's from Salon Centric. I have no idea the brand. I kind of just feel and like, if the comb is really sturdy, then good to go. Okay, so on days where I'm just really feeling like my hair is greasy or I don't wanna take a shower that night and like wash my hair, um, I will put this Tresemme dry shampoo in my hair and I always put this in at nighttime. I don't wake up and put this in my hair. My hair doesn't take to dry shampoo very well. I don't know, I feel like it needs to sit in for a while. So usually I'll spray dry shampoo at nighttime and then I'll wake up and my hair is less oily. So I think those are all my hair products that I use. Like I said, a lot of them are very similar. Some of them are different, but I thought it would be helpful for you guys because you guys have been asking me a lot of these questions. So if there's anything you guys suggest, let me know. I am always down to try new products. I absolutely love playing around with them. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in my next one.